Aquí me pongo a cantar, aquí canto la primera. Bien cantando la segunda, cantaré la que yo quiera. Un barco veo venir por el alto de la Veo venir cansadito de remar, de remar. El navío se. Hello, I am Natalia Armijo Canto from Mexico, and I am very happy to greet you and invite you to a wonderful musical journey through the Caribbean. We are guided in this adventure by the musical band Los Chapulines. Do you know the meaning of the word Chapulines? Chapulines are grasshoppers, bouncy and noisy insects, associated with movement and music, as shown in the fable, The Ant and the Grasshopper. Do you remember that story? Music is the main protagonist. They show the cheerful cricket as the antagonist of the hard-working ant. But the real story is different. Music has accompanied humankind in moments of solace, recreation, deep reflection, and also during time of hard work and struggle. Precisely, this program began with the rhythmic song of Las Panadera, which was used as a troupe or comparsa for work days in rural areas in Castilla. These are the lyrics of the chorus. I see a ship coming from the top of the sea. I see a ship coming and I have to leave. i 
sus zapatitos nuevos haciendo tanta mudanza o bailando bien sus ciegos pegados panza con panza con sus zapatitos nuevos haciendo tanta mudanza o bailando bien sus ciegos pegados panza con panza es un go through the sea and suddenly a magical moment arises when two grasshoppers jump coincide landing in the same space at the same time and begin to dialogue through the universal language of music that was what happened when Graciela Saera Moraña originally from Castilla crossed the Atlantic Ocean and reached the Mexican Caribbean There, on the shores of the beautiful Laguna de Bacalar in Quintana Roo, she met Beto Robledo Zaragoza, who had been making music in the region for a long time. This is how Graciela's violin joined with Beto's jarana and zapateado to begin a journey of songs and music to the rhythms of the Caribbean. After Las Panaderas, We listen to the Son de los Negritos. This music from the south of the state of Veracruz in Mexico is known as Son Jarocho. The generic Spanish term Son is widely used throughout the Spanish speaking Americas to refer to different song and dance styles, as we will listen in this program. But when the word song is followed by the term jarocho, it refers to people and all things in Veracruz, including their fast-paced song and dance style, 
which combines musical elements of the Spanish colonists, indigenous groups, Africans, and also Arab roots. The coasts of Veracruz are not washed by the Caribbean Sea, but by the Atlantic Ocean. However, historically it is a site of huge significance in this Caribbean journey. The port of Veracruz was the most important entry point into the mainland for merchandise, culture, and enslaved people from Africa. The Afro element is common to all Caribbean music. The rhythms and songs are a marvelous example of a culture in resistance, longing for freedom, reaffirmation, and deep cultural encounter are the predominant features of Caribbean music. Let's now listen to Bemba y Tablao, another Afro son Jarocho by Patricio Hidalgo. Then we will keep traveling with the music to visit other places in the Caribbean. Tarima tumba y cajón, de donde viene tu encanto. Tarima tumba y cajón, de donde viene tu encanto. Me viene del corazón de monte sereno y santo. Me viene del corazón de monte sereno y santo.
Wow, what a good rhythm. At Bemba y Tablao, we heard the complete ensemble of Chapulines. Anton Kindekes from Belgium is the group's percussionist. His rich and diverse set of percussion sustains the rhythm and sonority of the group. The bass is the musical instrument of Denis Nicholas Cobas, originally from Cuba. He brings the low bass notes that give depth when the tracks come to life.
The drum solo was performed by Jose Vindel, a guest musician from Honduras, who took us to the heart of the Garifuna culture. In 2001, UNESCO proclaimed the language, dance, and music of the Garifuna people a masterpiece of the oral and intangible heritage of humanity. This precious heritage has its roots in Caribbean indigenous and West African cultures, which came together when two Spanish slave ships sunk in the 17th century near islands in the Lesser Antilles. The mixing and integration of cultures gave rise to the Garifuna society. As islands were conquered by the Spanish, French, and British, the Garifuna wound up on the coast and bay islands of Honduras, and afterwards they spread all along the Central American coast. Drums are the heart of the Garifuna music, the backbone of Garifuna culture, and the privileged means to maintain a spiritual bond with the ancestors. Garifuna music has different rhythms and each one serves a specific function and has dances to go with them. The most popular ones are punta, a human fertility dance, and parranda. Today we'll listen it to Tili Bugudura, punta by Aurelio Martinez in the versions of Chapulines and Jose Vindel. But now is the time for these grasshoppers to take a big leap and fall on the island of Merengue. With its African and Spanish influences, Dominican Merengue is a new world music and style rooted in old world traditions. There are two popular versions about the origin of merengue. One story alleges the dance originated when slaves who were chained together and then of necessity, they were forced to drag one leg I guess cut sugar to the beat of the drums. The second story alleges that a great hero was wounded in the leg during one of many rebellions in the Dominican Republic. A party of villagers welcomed him home with a victory celebration. And out of sympathy, everyone dancing felt obliged to limp and drag one foot. The first part of our musical journey through the Caribbean comes to an end with the Patacón Pisao, which translates as flattened plantain. In this merengue, sung by Johnny Ventura, the singer demands repeatedly to be fed with Patacón Pisao. So, bon appetit, see you soon to continue this musical adventure with Chapulines. Patacón pisao, pisao, patacón pisao, pisao, patacón pisao. 
Josefina le pone plato sofisticado. Josefina le pone plato sofisticado. Pero él no se lo come. Él reclama pescado. Pero él no se lo come. Él reclama pescado. Si me dan otra cosa, 